Hey guys, welcome to the homestead. So doing a quick video for you today. It's 4th of July, getting ready to head out to um, a friend's house and we're gonna do a barbecue and shoot off some fireworks and bottle rockets. Can I bring this? To show yeah, you, you can bring it. Okay. So um, me and the boys are getting ready to leave. Jamie's gonna be here along later. And so we're getting ready to head over to do some 4th of July celebrating. And um, you know, something hit me as I was looking at my comments and my emails today. Uh, I saw a picture of this, this picture right here of these squash bugs. Someone wanted to know what they were, and all the people were like, oh my gosh, you got to kill them because they're going to, you know, take over your squash. And somebody uh, on this homesteading um, uh, Facebook group said, you know what, you're just going to lose them. You might as well just offer them up to the bugs and, you know, you get what you get. If you don't get any, you just don't get any. And I was like, no, 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 you got to fight. You got to fight, 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 because that's how you get, if you just give up, if you have this defeatist attitude, you're not going to get any of your squash. You can let the squash bugs get all of it. And I'm like, no. And it's just this defeatist attitude. If you have a defeatist attitude when you're homesteading, no homestead for you. You're not, no homestead for you because you've got to fight. You know, the garden every year is a battle. Life is a fight. You can't give up. You've got to just have that, that I'm going to keep trying attitude. Yes, many times you're going to lose in life. Many times you're going to be defeated in your attempts to succeed. But you must continue to fight. And today we just have a defeatist attitude all throughout America. And you, you, you come across people like this on this homesteading group and other places too. They're like, uh... Yeah, you're just going to lose. You know, might as well, just let them have it. Just let the squash bugs have the squash. No! Yes, you're going to lose some. But, you know, like I've said in other videos, when you plant plants, you, you always plant more than you think you're going to need because you're going to lose some. You're going to lose some battles along the way. But it doesn't mean you stop fighting. It doesn't mean you just give up. You know, it's 4th of July. Uh, you're probably watching this video after the 4th of July. And... People are raising cane about seeing U.S. tanks on the National Mall. You know, our president has decided to celebrate the 4th of July and he wants to put tanks and he wants to have military jets fly over the mall. And so many people are offended at this. We have never done this as a country. That's ridiculous. John Kennedy, during the Cuban Missile Crisis, he, he paraded an ICBM, Intercontinental Ballistic Missile, a nuclear missile on the National Mall or down Pennsylvania Avenue as a parade, an ICBM nuclear missile. He was a Democrat. I mean, and people didn't raise a fuss about that. And and people are getting all upset about this Nike shoe with the Betsy Ross flag on it. And Barack Obama had the Betsy Ross flag hanging at his inauguration. No one raised a fuss about that. It's a defeatist attitude that America has today. You know... Americans, like Patton said, Americans love a winner and will not tolerate a loser. Sure, you're going to lose at times in your life. But you, if you continue to, you know, expend energy and never give up trying, there's going to be many times where you win. And to, America today has a defeatist attitude. A lot of America today does. I'm thankful that many, much of America does not have a defeatist. There's so many people today who, who believe that you have to keep trying, that you can't give up. I'm raising my boys to have this attitude. Don't give up. Always fight. Never be a defeatist. Never surrender. Where have we gone as a nation? Yeah, that's right. Urgh. I mean, and help the little guy who has been defeated alongside you. As you go, help others. You know, be, be a champion for, for those who are weaker than you are. But never give up. Listen, if you're going to grow squash just to give it to the squash bugs, you're going to have a defeatist attitude like that. No homestead for you. No homestead for you. All right, we'll leave it at that. See you next time in the homestead. Have a great fourth. Hope you had a great fourth. Hey, hey there. Thanks for watching our channel. If you're looking for great off-grid homesteading videos, this is the channel for you. Hit that subscribe button and be sure to like the video you just watched. You can also feel free to send us your questions by going to anamericanhomestead.com on our contact page and send me your question. Your question might get made into a video. In the meantime, check out some of these other great videos.
Oh, wait. Go ahead and click them. Go ahead. <laughs>